What's going on, y'all? What's going on, y'all? Um, there. I want to say this for the record. Uh, um, I know a lot of guys try to shame men who trick off. There ain't nothing wrong with tricking off. I'm gonna talk about tricking off in this video. It's nothing wrong with a man simping. It's nothing wrong with a man tricking off. Some men got to do that, you know. My daddy even told me he he's paid escorts for pussy before. Um, men who are not desired by women. That's that's really the, the, the lane that you have to step in. When you're a man that women don't find physically attractive, you know, you have to step in that simp role. That simp role, that simp tricking off role, you know. I noticed, uh, you know, for some reason, I, I don't understand why. Because back when I was in my twenties, I used to go to the gym, and I was going to the gym just to battle with my emotional issues. You know, that that was an outlet for me to battle with my emotional demons. But I never went to the gym to draw no holes, because going, I I, I don't believe that working out will draw any holes to you. If you ain't never been a desirable man working out in the gym, it ain't going to do shit for you. Um, yeah, that's what I want to that's what I wanted to say. Uh, you know, you know, uh, you know. People need to stop telling folks this bullshit about uh, going to the gym. That ain't going to do nothing. You know, you know, if you didn't have women liking you as a teen, going to the gym ain't going to do shit. Uh, but far as tricking off, uh, you know, that's that's the lane that some men got to step in. You know, I know they say they tell guys that they shouldn't trick off and stuff. You know, some men got to trick off on women. You know, some men got to play that simp role. Um, I ain't going to lie to you. You know, um, like like I said in my last presentation, uh, that bitch who ignored my phone calls and text messages. Um, that bitch who ignored my phone calls and text messages. If I had at least a minimum of $5,000, I'd pay her $1,000 cash. I'd pay that girl $1,000 cash and uh, I'd take her out to Ruth Chris. You know, I'm guaranteed, I, I, I truly believe I'd get some pussy. I'd get something out of the deal. I know people were saying that, oh, if you, if you paid a woman $1,000 cash and took her to Ruth Chris, she ain't gonna give you nothing. I disagree. I feel like if you did that for a woman, you bound to get something in return. Um, I know a lot of y'all guys don't believe in tricking off on women, but I, I I feel like if you a man that women ain't attracted to, that's the lane you got to step in. You know, that's pretty much what you're going to have to do as a man. You're going to have to trick off, you know, and play that simp role. You know, I just wish, you know, um, you know, people would stop telling dudes who've never been wanted to get in the gym. That's getting old. You know, you know, some dudes are just not ladies men. You know, some dudes are just not ladies men. Some dudes are just not that guy. You know, going to the gym ain't going to do nothing for some people. You know, it's not it's not going to better their situation at all. Um. You know, uh, people need to stop telling people that bullshit by going to no fucking gym. Going to the gym ain't going to do shit. You know, tricking off and, and simping. I, I, I see that that's the lane that some men got to step in. You know, if you a dude that women ain't checking for, bitches don't find you attractive, you're going to have to start simping and tricking off on hoes. You know. You know, like that's that's the that's the lane, because I guarantee if I'd have paid that girl, if I had five grand 
if I'd have gave that girl $1,000 cash and took her to Ruth Chris, I guarantee I'd have got some ass out of LMA. I believe she would have fucked me. You know, um, tricking off and simping. That's what some men got to do. You know. And uh, I just been thinking about that situation. You know. You know, the girl from that Taco Bell that didn't reply to my text messages on my phone call. You know, I'm tr I truly believe that uh, if I would have done that, I'd have got something out of her. You know. You know, uh, my advice is, you know, s start simping and tricking off on these women. That's what that's what men got to do. That, that's, that's what some men got to do. If you a dude that women ain't checking for, if you a dude that, uh, you know, women ain't trying to mess around with, you're going to have to pay women for their time. You know, you know, some men got to do that, you know. And it ain't nothing wrong with paying a woman to fuck with you. That's what some men got to do. You know. You know. Because, you know. It's getting, it's, getting rough, it's getting rough out here. It's getting, it's getting tougher and tougher out here. And you got a lot of dudes. They don't meet the expectations of these bitches. So. Some men going to have to just do what they got to do. You know. Because I ain't going to lie, man. It, you know, if I, I tell myself. Boy, only if I had five thousand dollars, I could go back to that Taco Bell, get that girl a thousand dollars. I rent a car, and we'll go to Roof Chris. I guarantee I get some pussy. I one hundred percent believe I'd get some ass if I did that. You know, but that's all I wanted to say. You know, I wanted to just talk about tricking off and simping. You know, that's really the uh, alternative for some dudes. You know, some dudes got to trick off and simp for these women, because if women ain't checking for you and they ain't showing no interest in you, that's what you're going to have to do. But my message is, dudes, just start simping and tricking off, you know, you know, just realize you're just going to have to buy women. You know, you're going to have to pay these hoes to fuck with you, you know, and that's all I pretty much want to say. See you guys later.